Hey everyone, it's Philip from Days Gone by Vintage Market. Hope you all have had a great weekend. It has been forever since I've been on here uh, doing a live. So I thought I would jump on. Land and I have been working on getting stuff priced tomorrow for the live sale. Uh, I've gotten in about eight boxes. Uh, so we were pricing all that stuff. And whatever doesn't sell, we'll go over to Lakewood 400. So if you're wanting something, I would go ahead and buy the stuff tomorrow because usually after Lakewood, there's hardly nothing left. So I'm going to give you a few minutes to jump on, I sprinkle it out, let everybody know that I'm live. Hey, uh, Karen, it's good to see you on here. Hey, um, I think you're new, Nebra. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It says we have 12 people. Hey, Jill Edwards, um, keep on sprinkling it out. I'm going to show you what we're going to have on the live sale tomorrow for my live sale. There will be a live sale with Penny Kopeck also. With her handmade items we may combine them i don't know it all depends on what all we get shown tomorrow at 11 30. um but anyways i hope you're all ready for americana americana is not just for fourth of july americana is a great decor to have out all summer long so uh because you can put it up i don't know if it's labor day or memorial day whichever of those is first i cannot remember but from then all the way into September would be great for Americana. And a lot of people just have Americana room uh, where they have all their Americana stuff in it. So, hey, Brenda uh, Woods and Glow, I don't know if I'm able to see any comments. So we're just going to show items and uh, I'll go back and read comments if there's any comments. So here is our Americana stuff that we have for tomorrow. Uh, a lot is handmade. Some of it is not handmade. Some of it is... Um, from wholesale which a lot of my handmade stuff is wholesale that an actual person makes but which i'm sure all of this is all made by hand but some's probably made from a china little china woman or or something like that but i do have a lot of handmade stuff that is from the united states hey linda southern um we had these last year those were a very good uh seller those are handmade by somebody in the united states we have the little liberty uh and all uh, we had her last year. I think we only had a few of her because we couldn't get any more left. I was able to get two this time. There is a watermelon hanger with a mouse on top of it. The blue star right there is handmade by somebody. I think she's from Kentucky. The cow is new. Mason the cow is new. Uh, this little gnome guy is handmade by somebody from the United States. I just don't know who from. Uh, you have seen this before. It's uh, a hole, I think. The greenery is something that I've gotten new this year. Last year, I had the candle ring, which is this right here. But this year, I've got the pick that also matches it. Uh, Daniel the pig. He is super cute. Uh, here's another red star from the same crafter from Kentucky. I've had those before. All of you know about those. We have some more of the candle boards. Uh, we have the little hand-painted little tags that are handmade by somebody. I love the little chicken. Great for two-tier trays. We got the red, white, and blue beads. Great for uh, two-tier trays. This little uh, Pitberry candle ring is probably a little too big for this, but I do have candle holders that these will fit on. We have some more of the taper candles, the taper cup. Here's a two-tier tray. We have yo-yo garlands. If you don't want a garland, you can take the yo-yos apart and use them for your crafts. We have a star uh, self shitter sitter and we also have um uh, americana rag balls they come in a set of six and i have six sets available hey rosemary there's a little pillow tuck in there we have some pepper grass we have some more uh, rag balls back there that's a handmade tag we got towels which you can't see that towel button flags sammy the doll these absolutely cute firecrackers. Uh, we have some ladybug bow fillers. There's a frog pillow tuck made out of grain sack. There's another pillow ornament or tuck if you do a Americana tree. We have candle boards right here. Rusty taper candle holder. Uh, this is a new candle ring that I've, I'm trying out. Um, I love Uncle Sam doll. He's handmade by from Kentucky. Liberty doll. She's handmade from Kentucky. Everybody's going crazy over the stars that are handmade from Kentucky. Uh, love the Liberty mouse. There's a handmade Uncle Sam. 
this is hand painted metal star of course you know i love all of this restaurant wear uh liberty mouse i mean a liberty bunny she's super cute for you crafters i have a burlap americana ribbon heart star this is handmade and hand painted old glory there's another handmade uncle sam see you later there's a uh, americana basket love the americana candle board this candle ring will look cute on that candle board that's more of the Paper candles, we have a banner. We have the large uh, Pit Mary candle ring, which that candle ring would look good on that board too. Love Mary, love the Uncle Sam. There's another brown bunny, Liberty bunny. There's just a lot. This is just some of what will be shown tomorrow. So just wanted to jump on, get you all worked up for the live sale tomorrow. We'll be going live at 11.30 Eastern Standard Time here at Days Going by Vintage Market. And again, Americana is not just for 4th of July. It's a great summer decor. You can keep out all summer long or some keep it out all year long. So everybody have a great rest of your day. We got to go have a birthday dinner with Samuel at Longhorn Steakhouse. So everybody have a great rest of your day and we'll see you tomorrow.